In this tutorial, we'll look at how to change the select list option background color on hover in CSS. Okay, so I have a simple example here, just an HTML boilerplate. The only thing I've added here is a select element with three options. And this is what you'll get. This is the default styling that I get. Now, some users may use a different browser or operating system. And for them, this is going to look slightly different because the styling by default is actually determined by their computer, by their operating system or browser, right? And typically they don't want developers um, you know, changing that. So it's actually quite difficult to change it. Now we, we have sort of a hack to uh, change this. So that's what I'll show you. So what you can do is you can go in here and you need to set three things. So you need to do on focus, on focus, we are going to set the size to three. Let's see, I'm going to make this a little bit bigger. So when it's focused, we're setting the number of options that we should see to three, basically, that's what size means. Then on blur, blur is when you, is the opposite of focus, so when you click away. Then we're going to set this, that size is zero. And then the last option here is on change. Here we set the, the size to one, and then we also need to blur it. So we're basically setting um, the number of options to one when there is a change, and then also immediately blur it so that it's set to zero. Right, so it's a bit of a hack, um, but now what you can do, once you have these three things, you can just start select these options and style them. Right, so maybe, um, let's say option, I can select option. Right, maybe I want to style the, the first one, so I can say the option that is a first child. I can give that a particular background color. Let's say I want to make that, um, you know, aqua, aqua color, right? And then I could give the other two some other color. And actually I should do this in the hover state, right? So the first option in the hover state, right? The second child in the hover state should get a color of, let's say, orange. And the, the, the third option in the hover state should get a background color of, let's say, green. And now I'm going to save here. I'm going to refresh and you'll see that um, when we hover this, they get a different background color, right? Now, when you um, when you make the other one, um, uh, when you select the other one and then hover the first one, you'll see the aqua color, right? So it's a bit of a hack. Uh, there are third party libraries as well. If you if you uh, search for uh, select HTML select library, there will be third party solutions it will give you a similar result, but it's going to be a bit easier to change. So you don't have to hack your way around it to get the styling that you want. By the way, if this was helpful, I'd really appreciate it if you could like and subscribe. Also, check out my courses on CSS and JavaScript if you want to take those skills to an advanced level. Because in there, we will build some beautiful real-world projects from scratch so you can see how everything fits together and really master CSS or JavaScript. And I will also release other courses soon like React and Node.js. So if you want to be notified, then make sure you are subscribed to the email newsletter. You can find the link in the description. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon.